feel like, I feel like, I feel like Mike, Jordan, give me the rock and I'm scoring Ay, Came from the bottom, that's foreign I swear that I'm up for the sun in the morning Ooh, ay, I gotta flex, I need a Nike bag, give me the check I need the money and power, respect But I promise I'm repping the O to the day to love Slim Thug music back when I was younger, like in high school, yeah, I used to love his shit, I think the nigga's still pretty dope to be honest, mm. Mm. this has been a crazy month for me right now, man, crazy, like, I always expect around this time, like, you know, holidays or stuff, to not make as much as I usually make. But for the fact that, like, I've only been making, well, I've only made $300, you know, this month, which is crazy to me. And that was off of one event uh, for one hour. And the sucky part is like, I had to drive pretty far to get to that event and then to make only $300. I mean, I still needed the three, but you know, it kind of just is what it is. Like, I'm not sad about nothing or being low on money or nothing like that. 1000%, I know I'm gonna make money. I'm gonna, I handle business, I get stuff done. I'm always blessed. I always find my way uh, to do whatever it is I need to do, take care of whatever needs to be taken care of. I haven't paid uh, nothing late like like in like the last five years. That's why my credit is so dope. And, um, you know, rent, everything. I've always been on time last five years, and I've been broke several times in the last five years. So, you know, I handle business. You know, I don't give a damn what I'm going through. I'm going to handle my... And I don't let money issues stress me out at all, period. I don't overthink them or anything. Like, I just know things is due. Like, I just know whatever is due just has to be paid, period. So, I end up finding a way to pay that shit. And, you know, when you start it pretty much with nothing, um... Only thing can happen is I can go back to having nothing, <laughs> which I would never, I would never let happen, but it just doesn't scare me. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I can't explain it. You know what I'm saying? I've, I've been blessed enough to uh, do what comes to mind. You know what I mean? Like I used to do security and stuff like that. And the uh, last job I worked, the, the supervisor, he was a... Uh, he was really just a weenie, to be honest. Like, he was a weenie, a little cupcake, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a puss puss. And, you know, the way he tried to talk to me, dude, I really almost whooped his ass, to be honest. Like, uh, I was finna beat on that nigga, but I dropped it, you know, and I went on and just took the L and was like, you know what? I never let that happen again. Like, ain't nobody gonna ever be above me to be able to tell me what to do again i'd rather i'd rather uh grind out and you know decide my own fate than have someone feel like you know they got me paying my bills in their hand like just have that much you know control over like pretty much what i get done like 
Like, you know what I'm saying? And doing this and going through this type of stuff, it really ain't for everybody. So, you know, it's good to be able to get an education and get stuff handled and stuff like that. Only thing is, is for me, uh, that route just wasn't for me. You know? Um, everything I learned how to do, like business-wise, stuff like that, I pretty much learned on my own. Uh, picked up things as I go. Googled stuff I didn't know. Uh, YouTubed other stuff. And then, you know, trial and error. Basically, just got started, did whatever the hell, you know, I could do and just picked up everything else, like building a website. I picked all that, all that up on my own, you know, um, start from scratch and I was just playing around with it and end up like, this is a hell of a lot easier than these web developers like make it seem it's, it's easy. I mean, but if you're a professional, obviously it's going to come out a lot doper, but me, I built five websites on my cell phone. Only thing is, is, you know, this year I wasn't paying attention to them. And, you know, I let, I let them shut down and I reopened them because I wouldn't stand on top of it because I ended up like losing a card and I forgot that I had got a new card. And so I didn't replace it for the bill and stuff like that. And they ended up shutting down. So Google picked up on that. So it dropped my stuff down the list. And then I tried to get it back up, uh, you know, slowly it has, but it, it's not up far enough for me to pick up uh, X amount of work for the, the slow season. So that's pretty much what I'm looking at, man. But like I said, I'm not tripping because I'm still getting it done. Hold on, let me see. Like. I'm not tripping because I'm still getting it done. And even though I really only made $300 this month, I still feel good. <laughs> I still feel good, man. I'm still in a blessed position, man. You know, I still wake up with a smile on my face. Uh, you know, kids is good. Family good. You know, uh, still, I just still take care of business, man. And... The money I've spent this year, I spent a lot of money this year, like a lot. I made a lot and I spent a lot. And I spent it helping people who needed it. Um, you know, my baby sister, she flew out from uh, the, where she stayed at, I believe is Nebraska. She moved out there. She flew out. I spent like a bit on her. Uh, been on my kids um, getting them right for school and everything and a lot of other stuff and then also just enjoying enjoying my money you know what I mean while I'm still young and, and able to do what I'm doing because you know once you hit a certain age you know you slow down or you got other priorities to take care of so like I said it's cool it's cool with me I'm not tripping but just to let y'all know uh, owning a business man it can it could get to your ass. <laughs> like sometimes you'd be like, dang. What the hell? But that's all good, man. I'm not tripping. I can't miss. Diamonds on the neck and on my wrist. Now they trying to get me out of mix. That's why me and bro, we don't mix Told a friend, shawty, why you such a snitch? Yeah, I might do the dance, sell it quick Shawty brand new, just like the kicks And they mess a killer to whip Pockets fat, and my shawty looking thick Ayy, and my shawty looking thick Said she might be coming, I said I'ma need some pics I don't need nobody else to speak myself to say I just make clean money, I don't need to hit no legs Swear I got my fam, throw it out, it's on my life I can't trust nobody else to pay by my side Baby, you gon' learn, I'm not like these other guys We been working early, then we party every night Oh, I switch every Mmm, mmm
I'm not gonna lie, man. Um, it's kind of boring when you ain't got no money to spend. <laughs> like I got so used to making like 10,000 plus a month. And then all of a sudden, you know, the last two months it just dropped down. Uh, and I probably still got like another two more months to go. So I just gotta survive these next two months um, with this, this large ass car note, rent, and um, everything else that I got, you know, gotta pay. I still got credit cards and stuff like that. So that's why I'm not too worried about it. Like push come to shove. I got one credit card that I don't really use at all. And it has a $10,000 credit limit on it. So, you know, I pay with that. And then once uh, the money start rolling back in, I pay it off. That's why my credit is so dope, y'all. <laughs> and um, if you ain't got a credit card, definitely if you're young, like, you know, 18, just starting out, you want to get your credit right, make sure you get you a credit card, man. Start at like a, like a jewelry store, case jewelry, something like that. They're going to give you a cool little limit and uh, just work your way up from there. Never miss a payment, ever, ever. And then you'll be able to hop into whatever car you want, like maybe in a year or two. You know what I mean? If you do it right, you do it correctly. So, you know, just stay focused out here, man.